silly question. How long do you think it'll take before CD t- C reach world domination? Oh, uh, that's quite quite information. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been part of CDC? Oh, geez, about ten years now. Really? Yeah. So, um, is there anything else you'd like to say, to, especially to everyone watching? Oh, uh, well, uh, to everyone watching. We were going to do this the the the, um, the release, but uh, we we ran long, so uh, something for cut. Um, basically, I want to tell people out there who are watching this, particularly the the young kids getting involved in programming. You know, we're coming up on the new millennium, and the choices you make today, next year, next century, this is going to have profound a profound impact on the lives, you know, a profound and unknowable impact on the lives of the 90% of humanity that's alive today that has never made a phone call, that doesn't know what a light bulb is. <laughs> you know, you laugh, but it's true. It's true. Um, you know, we'll look up at the sky at night and see these sparks hurling across the sky, this night sky, and don't know that they're satellites. <laughs> and, as I said before, any fool can throw a brick through a window. Yeah. Any fool can... Uh, can destroy a hard drive, but it takes an artist, someone genius, to create a stained glass window, or to write good software. Now, the analogy I use when I talk about this is, in 10 years, now we are going to have bionic eyeballs. People who have been blind since birth will see. Now imagine, you're blind, you've been blind since birth, but you're married, you have a wife and kids, you've never seen them. And then one day, the doctor says, okay, we're going to turn your eyes on. Pow, you can see. And you can see your wife. And you can see your children. Imagine. Imagine how you you would feel. And now imagine, you're the guy that wrote the code for those eyes. 